Let's beat you, bitch. <laughs> yeah, please cut that out. <laughs> Here in the salon down in Laguna Beach, California, and we're so excited to be here with you guys today, right? Oh yeah. Yes. Um, no, we actually had the opportunity. Uh, when was it? I feel like this has been like the longest week, the ever, longest week ever. I mean, welcome to January. <laughs> I think gonna... it was on Tipsy Tuesday. I Tipsy, remember that. Yes. We were offered margaritas, <laughs> and we partook of those margaritas, and they were sure wonderful. Did. Um, no, we actually went down to LA. We went and worked with Maine Addicts. If you guys have not heard of them, go ahead and head over to Instagram and click the little follow button. They're an amazing hair blog, and if you love hair as much as us, you will absolutely love the blog. Um, we are very passionate about hair and hair extensions, and so we wanted to show them a little taste of Natural Beauty Rose. Um, we drove down there, we got my driver, hopped in Louis? the- Louie? We got Lou. Louie or Lou? Oh, I thought it was Louie. <laughs> I like that you call him Louie. I'm gonna call him Louie. Louie! <laughs> so we uh, jumped in the car with Louie, and <laughs> we headed down to LA, and we- <laughs> Don't forget about eating oh. nasty sprouts. Oh. <laughs> Louis gave well, me whiplash for his driving. Well, here's how the story. Here's, here's how the story starts. I'm running a little late, and Stacy's here, like a good Stacy would be here, packing my stuff up. I'm like, I got this. I'll pack the stuff. No, no, no. Her exact words were, <laughs> "Stacy's gonna screw this up. I'll do it." <laughs> I feel like that wasn't my exact words. I'm a little nicer. <laughs> I only say that to Val, not you. <laughs> so anyway, we get down there. I brought like at least 15 bags of hair only to realize I forgot the one bag that I really needed, but that's cool because I can improvise. We are just hard at work, custom coloring some hair. Stacy, good work. <laughs> the best way Where did mouth go? <laughs> We thought we would be doing hair in a salon. We didn't really didn't know where we were going, but it was in an office building. And I felt like the transformation was quite amazing. Was. Um, I loved it. It was on Ashley. She is she their PR director or is she? Mm. I don't know. Stacy set it up. Stacy's my PR director, <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like Stacy, reach out to them. Um, I know that Jen Atkins was the one that she's the one that started the blog and all that. And yeah. she actually was originally from Utah. And I read her story, and I'm from Utah. And I was like, oh, I want to work with them. So um, we drove down there. We had to color a lot of hair because I forgot the bag of hair that I initially wanted. But it really turned out amazing and we were we were washing hair in a bathroom sink <laughs> trying to make it work. But it was like very real life. And she's like, you guys do house calls? I'm like, we do, we will. We do. We do and will. We sure we do now. We do now. So anyways, it was an amazing experience and she actually had very uh, like short coarse hair. And I didn't do a ton with her color, honestly, just because we were limited in space and supplies and I wanted to make it look the most fabulous I could. And I think sometimes with color, like for stylists, sometimes you overthink it and when you overthink it and do too much, you're like, ah, shit, I'm in trouble. Yeah. And I didn't want to overthink it. I just wanted to take what she already had and make it a little more current. We actually kind of like, I just like melted her color down a little bit and toned her ends. That's all I really did with her color. Um, left kind of a little face frame around and blended we literally blended like six colors right yes it was a lot <laughs> it was a lot <laughs> but and it looks so natural as well it, it looked good because honestly a lot of times with my clients i'm like i want it to be at least shoulder length and her hair was above shoulders and it was kind of thick so it was definitely a challenge but a good challenge and and i knew it could do it if i had an unlimited amount of hair and colors which we brought except for the one color we needed <laughs> good, good job team you just thought you'd give yourself another little challenge i did i wanted to keep it real in between painting hair color on the toy <laughs> it, was, it was a good time so anyways but it's an amazing experience like what did how did you guys feel about it like share some of your inside story go it makes me want to do more things like that yeah Putting it makes me see how putting yourself out there and going outside of your comfort zone could be so beneficial. I, think I learned it, a lot, it was fun, and then it's keeping me like, let's do more. Let's do more, for sure. I definitely think like networking is like, is like huge, and you never know, like eventually when you start to network and get to know people and get the name out there, and all of a sudden you have all these connections. So mm -hmm. it's, I think it's important to, yeah, like you said, like get, get out of your comfort zone a little bit, and and never never be too good for the job or to travel and just be really 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 willing to put in the work so ashley was asking me we actually were on their live story and then i put it on my live story but if you didn't catch the live story you can't go back and watch it because it's live and it goes away on instagram we should have done that on facebook anyways she was asking me some of like the top five questions that people want to know about extensions um one of them was how often do you have to maintain these one of them was like are they damaging to the natural hair 
and just kind of general questions that, that people want to know. So I kind of went in and, and talked about it. And I don't know if you guys know my story, people that are watching this, but I have done like every and any type of extension you can think of. And I've worn extensions in my hair for the past like 15 years. You've been wearing them for like... Probably 12 or 13. Yeah. Stacy. Um, on and off, never counted. Yeah, you have decent hair. Me, me and Val were like lifers with extensions. I do have decent hair. I'm getting buried in don't, hair. Don't let these bangs fool you. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Terrible kid rock hair. <laughs> <laughs> no, but I just, I have done like every and anything. And a lot of people ask like, how did you create this method? And I just took a combination of everything that I had learned and tweaked it and evolved it. And somewhere along the lines, I'm like, this is different than anything else I've learned. In, and it's and I won't put anything else in my own hair and I truly believe in the method and I've had great results with tons of different clients hair textures um, hair lengths hair colors and things like that so I personally love them and I wear them in my hair 24 7 so it's definitely I definitely believe in the brand I believe in the the product and it's I basically just created off my own sucky hair struggles my whole life and I thank you for that yes you are welcome you're welcome America <laughs> all right you guys thanks so much for tuning in to this week's video don't forget to check out the blog DKW styling for Tuesday tips every Tuesday and I love fashion so I actually do a fashion and lifestyle tip on my blog every Friday I call it Friday fashion but more importantly don't forget to reach out to get your amazing hair for 2017 <laughs> Not next year, today. Um, anyways, go ahead and click on the link below. That's going to take you directly to my contact information where you can reach out and join me and the team here in a good week. So you've seen a little bit of the process. Now come experience the process. All you need to do is click the link below. That's going to take you directly to my blog where you can go to my contact page and reach out to me. Whether you're a curious student or you're just another girl that loves hair, either way, don't be shy make sure to click on the link below.